Hello everyone. This video would focus on the basic information about the vertex form or the graphing form of absolute value equation. Before we go farther, please feel free to check out the description box below for the link of the other series of topics related to absolute value equation in graphing or vertex form. We remember that the equation for an absolute value equation in graphing form or vertex form is y equals a absolute value of x minus h plus k. Now let's go over the effects of the parameters a, h, and k to the graph of an absolute value equation. We remember that if a is positive, the graph opens upward. Now, if a becomes zero, then the graph becomes a straight horizontal line. On the other hand, if the value of a is negative, the graph of an absolute value graph will open downward. Now, we also remember that this A is called the stretch factor, meaning it makes the graph vertically stretch, which makes it narrower, or it makes the graph horizontally compressed, which makes it wider. We remember that the closer the value of A is to zero, then the graph becomes wider. So if you notice, the graph gets wider. We started from the negative side and then we go towards the zero. It becomes wider and wider to the point that if it gets to zero, then it becomes a horizontal line. This is also the same thing for the other side. So if we start from 10 right here, we go all the way to zero, then the graph becomes wider and wider up to the point that it becomes so wide that at zero, it becomes a horizontal line. On the contrary, we remember that the farther the value of A is from zero, meaning if we go towards the negative side, then the graph becomes narrower. So as we go farther from zero, it becomes narrower. We remember that the coordinates H, K is the vertex or the locator point of the graph where our H translates the graph left or right while the k translates the graph up or down. That's it. If you found this video helpful, hit like and subscribe for more math videos. See ya!